This is the Specialized Stump Jumper Alloy Frame S4. Drop the device. Get away from that keyboard. Step outside. Into Shred World. The frame uses progressive geometry in six sizes to offer balance, front and back stiffness, and agility. The short offset fork and steep seat angle make it suitable for every kind of trail. The frame features internal cable routing. There's a horse pivot adjustment near the rear cassette. The flip chip allows adjustment of the bottom bracket to change the bike's geometry. There's no doubt about how much tension to use. This alloy frame bike weighs about 35 pounds. The alloy handlebars are 780 millimeters wide. They're held to the stem by this smooth bark clamp. The grips lock on to the handlebars. The thumb shifters are on the right side. These are SRAM, SS Eagle, Trigger, 12 speed. They are easy to access and are quick and responsive when you need them to be. The brake levers operate the front and rear hydraulic disc brakes. We'll have more information about these brakes when we get to the rotor and the pads. The hydraulic fluid is mineral oil. The seat is a body geometry bridge saddle with steel rails and the usual adjustments. The seat post is a transact drop. The control for the dropper seat is on the left of the handlebars. Press the button and use body weight to lower the seat. Press the button and take your weight off the seat to raise it. Being able to change the seat height while riding makes climbing more efficient and makes descending more comfortable. The fork features a RockShock 35 Silver. It has 140 millimeters of travel. Remove the cap on the left to access the air valve. Suggested air pressures are listed on the left fork. The rebound and lockout adjustments are on the right. The rear shock is X-Fusion O2 Pro RL. There is a rebound adjustment, lockout, and air valve underneath. It has 130 millimeters 
of travel. The full suspension smooths out those roots, ruts, rocks, and other obstacles. The brakes are Tektro Gemini Comp. Two hundred millimeter rotors on the front, one hundred eighty millimeter rotors on the rear. It's a good combination to help control your speed. The cranks, derailleur and chain are all SRAM SX Eagle 12 speed. There's a SRAM cassette with 11 to 50 teeth. These all work together to power you to wherever you want to go. The wheels have through axle hubs, both front and rear. The quick release needs to be aligned with this slot to unscrew the hub. The 29 inch tires come with tubes and Presta valves. The front and back tires are not identical. The butcher grid has more rolling resistance, so it's on the front. The purgatory is made to run on the rear wheel. The tread patterns are a little different. The tires are made for trails, but they're good on any surface. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, why not like and subscribe?